Here is what we can tell you. The Boise State football team received their final COVID test results yesterday morning. At that moment, they were given the thumbs up to board their chartered plane bound for Hawaii yesterday afternoon. The Broncos touched down on the island right around 8 o'clock in the evening last night, and they were excited to do so. We've heard that uh, guys on the Hawaii football team take a lot of pride in protecting the island. It, it, it's the same type of investment that you guys have in protecting the blue. As someone that played over a dozen games at Aloha Stadium during your high school career, how much can you relate to that? You know, all those guys back home, a lot of them on the team are local guys. So, you know, you're born and raised on the island and we're very prideful people and proud of the place that we come from and, you know, the people that that uh, we have in our circle. So I know exactly, you know, how they feel because that's kind of the same pride that we took in high school, you know, with our high school home field. Um, it's the same pride we take now. So I know exactly, you know, how they grew up what their mentality is about home and how they really, you know, love that place. You know, Hawaii's gonna do everything they can to protect that place and, you know, elevate their game when they're playing at home too. Avery, with all that is going on right now, what is it like just to make it to game day and know that you and at least 52 of your other teammates are, are good to go and, and do what you love to do? It's good, it's a good feeling because, I mean, you really don't know uh, if the game's going to happen or not until the game happens. I mean, you know, God forbid, but I would assume it's a possibility we could fly over there for six hours and the game might not happen, which is which would suck a lot. But uh, it's great to put the pads on, get the countdown in pregame and go out there and just have fun with the guys.